hi guys you're welcome back to my channel and in this video i will be taking you guys on a tour of our two bath two bed apartment in calgary Alberta. this is not downtown calgary so the environment here is quite serene and beautiful in this house we have access to a gym downstairs and a room or a much more bigger space i would say in case you want to host friends families guests or you want to have a get together and you don't want to do that in your apartment you can do that in that room but I can't really show you guys that in this video because we just moved in and we haven't sent our proof of vaccination yet. So until we do that, we don't have access to that space or to that amenity. So yeah, come along with me and let's move in together, guys. empty house tour vlog i hope i'm doing this right i just brushed i just showered i showered all the negativity away and we're ready for today okay let's go <laughs> literally just been staring at this balcony from inside like so guys how can i compare this the typical way i can describe it for you guys or tell you how this cold is is if you've been to the north if you stayed in kaduna abuja zaria you know those places joss how it is cold like during november december january time that's exactly how cold it is right now and it is just fall it's not winter yet so like that cold multiply it times probably two that is how it is and i'm just wondering like how are we going to cope well me how am i going to cope when it's snowing but i think i'm doing well i just breathe with my mouth i don't breathe with my nose so that my nose doesn't pain me or hurt me so that's the truck that is just gonna park the table and the bed i don't know if you guys can see it outside offload again we packed everything into the car but i could not show you guys guys we're finally inside the apartment and let's begin this apartment empty apartment tour well that was a lie because immediately i wanted to start the empty apartment tour the furniture people called me that they were five minutes away so immediately we started cleaning the apartment the living area so that the furniture can actually stay there i'm so sorry guys but this is about to be a roller coaster
Hey, to say I'm tired is an understatement. I'm beyond tired. I'm really, really tired. So, like, I wanted to do an empty house tour, but I could not because people were just coming in and bringing stuff and all of that. And they were just interrupting the video. It's not going to be entirely an empty house tour. We're still going to see some things in the house, but right now we're on our way to Dollarama and um, we also want to get a rug for the living area because it can get really cold yeah in all i really love the apartment it's beautiful it's cozy it's small i love small spaces and i can't wait to like decorate and just you know make it more more like a home so yeah and the people here are so nice they are super 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 nice i don't know like everybody we've been meeting since when we've been unpacking and bringing stuff in they've been like hi they're smiling you know they're helping you hold the door they're just super nice honestly nigerians hey they be frown face like they did not see you or they no send you but yeah it's just amazing here Is because we bought stuff worth over hundred dollars they gave us some gifts so let's let's check what they give us together <laughs> brown rice mild curry it's just one dollar Who's this? Sliced pear. Ha. I'm going to. This is just drinking your intestine. Healthy intestinal flora. Somebody's got it all over. guys like when you come in you're gonna come in through this door this green door here and we have this long um hallway mat i would say just for you to put your feet on then we have this we have this like foot mat as well for probably when it's snowing you want to put your shoes so when you're coming through this door the first thing you're going to see straight ahead is the living area and i know this is supposed to be this is supposed to be an empty <laughs> apartment tour but we already moved in kind of and i couldn't make the video because like a lot of people were coming to drop stuff so i just had to like just keep my phone and help out so this is like a semi empty <laughs> empty apartment tour because we have some things in the apartment already so please just do with it just do with this video so yeah this is the living area like i said earlier and we later settled for the three-seater couch and a love seat so this is what we just put in the living area and this is my blanket i use it when i'm seated here because i get really cold the view is beautiful So to the right of the living area, 
we have um we have the tv 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 stand from the living area as well you also have like an access or you have a view to what the kitchen look like picture of myself and somebody's son this is a play track with some few plates because we are just two and then here we have a table mat in case you want to eat then this is a plant i got yesterday but i'm really confused as to where to put it i've been shifting it around or i've been putting it around i put it here i put it there close to the frame but i don't know i later opted to put it here i don't know which looks better so the second um food mat and a bus to just a bus to that we got gray in color so you could match with the couch and just some chewing gum then a very white plain island we have the trash can here and then we have a hand sanitizer so it has a two-sided sink and this is just turkey that we brought out to the first and then the other side of the sink as well and then you have um the tap where water comes out from then if you keep on going the blender black this is your view from the kitchen like to the living room we have a dishwasher which i doubt we would be using but it had, the house comes with a dishwasher and some storage spaces down we just put put that well so we just put some cleaning stuff there and this place is basically empty another storage space for just my like, cooking oil and some pots and some pans and that's it then to this area I really love this kitchen so here we have um, a set of knives here and a pair of scissors in there then we have hold on I just did something then we have a skillet more like a frying pan here the regulator here then we have a kettle yeah we do all the cooking here and I just cooked and you have all the control there then you have the microwave here then we just have another storage space here storage space here another storage space here then we have the tissue here then my air fryer just eggs that i'm bringing out to the first i don't know why there are eggs here it's white it is not cooked egg actually thought it was cooked egg the first day i saw it <laughs> until when i touched it and it was so hard so yeah this is another storage space with just cutleries storage and last storage then we have the fridge this door leads to the pantry so this is just like another storage space again for food i just decided to maximize the space by putting all the cartons of things i unboxed here i'm heading back to the door now because it's a door there's another door to your left once you come in so from this door as well you also have access to see what is going on in the kitchen and from the kitchen you can see what is going on in this room and this is another storage space guys <laughs> hey storage space all the quite too much <laughs> so in this room we just want to put like our winter jackets here as you can see but we don't have hangers for now so we'll get hangers and we'll just hang them on here so these are just food that i brought from nigeria that i've not unpacked here and then some of my husband's books that he has not unpacked as well this door is the washer and the, the washer and the dryer is this spinning so this house came with a washer and a dryer a refrigerator the microwave and the dishwasher so if you go to the left 
there are three doors let me go to the one that is opened so this is the second room in the house which will be practically empty because nobody is living with us so what i'm trying to do is to set this up as my like filming room and probably like a work from home kind of thing we have a desk and an office chair and another chair here so that is what i want to do i already have my ring light i brought from nigeria here but too bad guys the plug don't fit because this is how the sockets are here so i need to get an adapter i totally forgot about that so here this is the window and we have a very beautiful view here as well this is so serene and so beautiful can you guys see and guys everywhere in the house has this view this is the only light in the room all other light comes from this big huge window so there's a storage a storage here and the um, boxes that we won't be needing so that's it to this room once you come out of the room like the door here leads to the bathroom for the room so this is a tub this is a bathtub that i'm going to get curtains for this is for towels and this is where you have the switch and this is where you have a switch to on these vents so what this vent does is it blows air to the mirror in case you're having your bath with hot water i don't know if you guys notice that the mirror can get really like steamy i don't know if that makes sense so this is supposed to clear all the steam on the mirror and make it clear <laughs> this is the room and the door that is facing this room is just another storage space i just put our boxes here that's my backpack that's my laptop um bag and this is the show i the show i got from nigeria just some a pillow for like travel cups and um, my extensions i got from nigeria then I just put my bags in here because I don't have anywhere to put it. I put my headbands in here as well. So probably when I get my own space or a dresser or something, I'll put my, I'll arrange my bags there. Then here we have the bedspread my mom got me from Nigeria. I put them here as well. We have our duvet set here, throw pillows, sweets. And then here I have my jewelry, the rest of my jewelry is here. I have some rulers for sewing and my patterns there as well. So that is it to this storage space. <laughs> was a gift from someone in nigeria and it's just a tissue box and i'm actually supposed to put it somewhere here this is the masters we have this light coming in here as well everything in this house is white like so you really really need to be careful so you don't get the walls dirty but yes there's another view in this room look at look at that closet closet i hope i got that right say what you want to say to me now i want to wake up with you is a new apartment.
apartment it is just built i think maybe last year or this year i'm not too sure so probably that is why everything here looks really really modern then we have our balcony so this is our balcony outside smells so nice and i'm scared of height so i'm not even going to pass here i'm just going to stay here hmm. but the outside is a lot of balcony so guys that's it to the apartment i can't wait to do a full um furnished apartment tour guys thank you for watching and i'll see you guys definitely in the next one bye